All departing and arriving flights from Terminal 3 and Terminal 2 are fully operational, while uh, flights at Terminal 1 have been cancelled. Arrivals are also operating. However, the departing flights from Terminal 1 are cancelled till 2 p.m. today. So these are the latest advi advisories that are coming in from the international airport. All departing and arriving flights from Terminal 3 and Terminal 2 are fully operational. However, terminal, all flights departing from Terminal 1 are cancelled till 2 p.m. today. So a roof has collapsed at Terminal 1. Rescue operations are underway. Uh, Anshul continues to stay with us on the broadcast. Anshul, take us through all the details that we are getting at this point of time, especially with how airlines are assisting the affected passengers so far. Well, definitely this incident happened at 5.15 a.m. this morning and uh, since then the, uh, there was a lot of confusion that was amongst the passengers who were travelling from uh, the national capital. They said that they, ha they have no clear idea as to what will happen to their flights. Now finally, uh, the airport authorities have come out with uh, some clarity approximately four hours after the incident has happened. They say uh, that the operations at Terminal 1 are completely suspended till 2 p.m. and the flights that were supposed to be departing uh, from Terminal 1 will take uh, will depart from Terminal 2 and Terminal 3 which will eventually mean uh, that there is going to be delay in other flights as well and also the people who are travelling towards the airport it has been advised by several of the airlines and also by the airport authorities that they should have extra time in their hands because you can see out here uh, in the visual this is the scene uh, that can be seen across the national capital across the nook and corners of the national capital where due to water logging there has been massive massive traffic jams that are being reported the entire delhi uh, seems to have been stopped at this point in time the national capital has been brought to its knees it seems at this point uh, because uh, such such scenes of heavy traffic jams water loggings uh, people trying to get to uh, get to their offices get to their workplaces uh, it's being seen from across the national capital and yet uh, there has been uh, no relief uh, that the people have been getting yes the traffic police is trying to work round the clock to make sure that the uh, that uh, that the vehicles that have been mal malfunctioned or that have stuck in this water uh, they can be uh, they can be taken out but definitely uh, this is something that yet again exposes the reality out here uh, in the national capital and how ill prepared uh, were the authorities uh, for the monsoon to for the monsoon to come out here to the national capital all the drains across the national capital are absolutely absolutely uh, blocked and that is the reason why uh, we are seeing that these water logging that is happening. Remember there has not been much rain that has happened out here in the national capital but yes uh, the way uh, the, the way the authorities were prepared definitely uh, it is the, uh, the, the brunt has to be faced by the people out here in the national capital and that is what we are seeing and that is what we are showing to our viewers on the TV screens. This is the kind of laxity that has been shown by the authorities due to which uh, there is a lot of a lot of issues that are being faced by people out here on the ground, especially not only out here in posh areas of the national capital. Currently, the visuals that you are seeing on your screens right now are from uh, are from the ITO, the Income Tax Office, uh, uh, Charaha, and you can see over here uh, that how uh, the traffic has been stuck over here for the last one hour. There has been barely any movement that has happened uh, in the traffic uh, traffic out here. Uh, once you go straight from here, right at Tilak Bridge, water logging is being reported. Uh, there as well, or not only at Tirak Bridge, but also at the infamous Minto Bridge as well. Water logging is being reported yet again. Not only out here in the NDMC area, but also water logging is being reported from places like Mo Model Town, Azadpur Sabzi Mandi, and uh, and other places of the national capital, places like Janakpuri, uh, in, in West Delhi, places in North Delhi, civil lines. All these places are reporting massive, massive water logging at this point in time. Definitely, a lot needs to be answered from the side of the MCD and from the um, from the agency as to what is the reason for this massive massive carelessness that has been shown due to which yet again the people of the national capital are facing such issues.